Alright guys, so what's up though, I'm back today, I got a quick Dragon Ball Z Dokken Battle video, I wanna do, yay! But yeah, we did get some actually, some quite interesting news this morning. Uh, if I'm covering, covering this really late, I'm sorry though, I've been doing all my videos, taking kind of forever. After this, I'm really mainly just doing recording for today, I got a lot of little side stuff I wanna record, lots of little stuff right here. So yeah, I'm not really tired of recording though, because I've been kind of like update, up to date and stuff like that. Yeah, because I, I think I, because last time I did that, I really just used face cam. But yeah, actually today though, we did get some new news right here. Um, for Trunks and Damasu, basically coming next for Dumb Goku. If you guys, if you guys actually see it right here, um, I'm actually open this up in a different tab. Um, we do have like the tickets right here, are Super Dokken Fest and Super Extreme um Dokken Fest tickets. Um, actually open up here. So yeah, like with these tickets, we already we always know like because with Dokken Fest, with Dual Dokken Fest anyway, for Global they always do tickets no matter what, which is always great. I always love it. They did it for Tech, Vegeta Blue, STR Rose. They did it for Super Saiyan Four Goku and Vegeta. For Global anyway, just Global, not JP. Hopefully, I really want JP to get these tickets because if you guys don't know, for um the um for their uh weekend summons, which they finally the time is recording Vegeta Super Saiyan Three Vegeta GT Vegeta. And Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, the physical one, that are global exclusive, they're finally on JP now, so I'll probably cover that in a few more days as well. Well, like, when we get more information, I will go over them as well for JP because a lot of people may not know about them. But yeah, though, like, we got stuff like this before, so I'm thinking, I was like, okay, so we could, you know, see more of this in the future. Like, I mean, just like for JP and we like, they have a whole bunch of tickets and stuff like that. I mean, there are fair stuff between Global and JP. I didn't want JP to get tickets though, because I don't feel like it's kind of fair for Global. I mean, if they can push the Vegeta in. Um, we we were really new for like the longest time, Vegeta and like, uh, G GT Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta and Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, the physical one, and the tech one for GT Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta. We already knew they were going to come to JP at some point. Just why can't Global get these tickets? In a way, I'm just saying, kind of like, I'm going to make this in kind of a discussion video as well. Not really a discussion video, but it's, just, it's I mean, everybody in the mall has talked about this. But I kind of want to see tickets come to JP as well. So, for anyway, let's get back to the news portion. But yeah, these are super and these are extreme. So, every time I guess we have someone on the banner, we'll get a random amount of tickets. Or a set amount of tickets. We'll get those. We'll that as like an extra ticket banner. It's basically the same banner no matter what. It's going to be the same banner like Trucks and the Moss too. We all saw how their banners are going to be structured. And like, for example, Super Saiyan 4 banners for, um... For us, we're going to get tickets for 300 million downloads. Like, after, like, when we summon and stuff like that. I'm really shocked they didn't do that for once. Because I did that, um, for Super Saiyan 4, if you guys don't know, they actually had tickets summons. So, you know, basically, when you summon, you get a set of amount of tickets and coins, like, for, for stones anyway. That, that, on the side, on the next part of the banner, you can see, on the next part of the banner, um, you can get, like, tickets at that you can summon on, like, the ticket version of that banner. And get like you know you can see like I don't know, you could get like Super Saiyan Four. It's basically like extra summons you can get. So yeah, for so far um this guys, I mean Chuckles and Master are basically confirmed for to be the next Death Confess. Again, we don't know too too much information, which we kind of knew they were gonna be around um this time. Let me see around like here so i feel like because tomorrow at times recording is halloween so i shout out to everybody happy halloween hope you guys enjoying halloween and stuff like that but um yeah though i mean chunks and Bazo could be around the beginning of this month like we could see like you know the essay animations or info them being like, we always see like the stuff being leaked first then after that we see um like shout out to Kawhi by the way too quiet and Doken air they always feed on all this good stuff shout out to them though they're always great for Doken virtual community love you guys thank you so much if you're watching this video if you see it a feature on your list or something like that yeah, because I don't know a lot of my videos get recommended to people. I do get comments on that. Like saying, oh yeah, your videos were re recommended to me. So I'll be like, yeah, hey, thank you. Um, thank you for watching anyway. So, you know. Um, but yeah, though. I do actually, on my Instagram, I tell the recording, I do post all my videos. So if you want to check out my Instagram, you can go ahead and do that. Um, this is blowing up with likes right now. So, yeah. Like, I remember all, overnight I, when I was asleep, there was like, so yeah. Anyway, back to Trunks of the Monster. So I feel like they'll be around here near Thanksgiving time. Because the Thanksgiving celebration, it was last year during, like, no, so it was during Super Gogeta and Int Janempa. Um, the Int and STR Janippas, um, Int, STR Janippa and Int Super Gogeta, they had the thank you celebration, so around Thanksgiving time I did, like, um, a few years ago, in 2017, so yeah, so we could see, you know, thank you celebration stuff here, um, cause I remember, and even, I think, Dokken did, yeah, in, um, when Super Saiyan 4 Full Power came out last year on Global, um, uh, near December for Christmas anyway, um, technically we got a hit for Christmas, plus New Year, uh, yeah, hit for Christmas, Slash technically New Year's, but yeah, like around the time. So we could, I think Thanksgiving's around this era. Um, I know my friend, she actually never celebrated Thanksgiving. She's kind of cool, though. Shout out to her. Um, but yeah, though, um... Um, see, I, I got, sorry, I got lost for a second. So yeah, around this time, I feel like we'll get, like, you know, the information leaked. Then that we'll get the essay animations, the info, the time they'll come out. Then after that, we'll get, actually get the banner and stuff like that. Then I like to go over it, like, the, um, celebration info. So, yeah, that's all I just really want to go to today. Hopefully the video wasn't longer or anything. So yeah, Chunks is a monster. Could be next for global. 
Um, or at this point, probably confirmed. But yeah, tell me what you guys think, though. So yeah, see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Have a great Halloween, great day, great life. Spooky ghosts, skeletons in the closet. See you guys later. Peace out.